so now you can see first thing sudo apt update very important you need to update so all done almost the command to install samba server sudo apt get install samba common samba this is how we install it and this is how i was installing even before right press here y so it is installed i need all of the services here taking little time so sudo add user so i'm going to add here user computer right then add password for this i always add the password and i always using one time of password because it's easy to remember then press y so user is created now now the next one sudo s m b p a w s w d password i'm going to create a password for newly created user so my new user is computer so now creating password for my new user computer to access my samba server so computer user can access samba services or share the resources on samba server now i'm going to do the configuration this is how i can do the configuration as well smb.con right this is the command to do the configuration now i'm going to create a file or a document which going to share with other as well so how i can do it so you see i'm going to create a document now the path you are going to give inside home directory i'm creating i have the user computer inside that i'm going to create this folder document and i say comment document means name is a document write table means you can write there yes we can write there 
Now, guest user can access it? No. Only computer user or the user I add on Samba server, they can share the resources. Not everybody can share the resources because we need to secure our resources. Anybody can make a mess with our resources. That's the reason I'm not sharing with everybody. I'll share with whoever is the valid user on working for me. So you can say this is how read only. No, this is not read only because I gave their right permissions as well. So this is all I created a document location and different privileges I gave here. So press and control X then Y and enter. So you go next now. Now I'm going to do here again system CDL SM. Okay, please start SMB. Samba services. <clears throat> Restarting. Now I will say started. After that, checking the status. Working all right. Right? So this is how it is going to work out for you.